sometimes ago i dropped this particular um message on our telegram community asking if you guys would love a tutorial on this effect after i came across it on facebook and then i got a lot of yeses from you guys a lot of you guys were interested in getting a tutorial on that and just recently i got another message from one of my wa family and he asked me for the same effect and then i've decided to create it in this video and show you how to also do that even if you have never used pixel app all your life even if you've never designed on smartphone all your life so stay around stick around follow me carefully while i take you on this short journey i will see you in the video all right once again you are welcome so quickly let's get right into it so this is the effect that we are dealing with here i'm going to save it i'm going to save to gallery and then I quickly i'm going to import it into um my uh pixel lab app yeah okay so i've imported um this image um like you can see i am not the owner of this design so i do not own the copyright to this design in fact i don't think this is the owner too it just posted it but then i just want to show you how to create this effect quickly now the first thing you need to understand is that this effect is very simple and that is why this video will not be too long now if you are new to my channel can don't forget to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to also smash the like button please hit the subscribe button and smash the like button so this is going to be a very simple um effect is actually very simple but then i want you to pay attention don't skip any part so that you don't miss any part all right um i'm going to hide this and then what you are going to do first in creating this kind of effect you need to prepare your text so if i zoom in and i zoom in into this um, work you can see that these are names of person this is ada sharon um Onuang or something adi wali dockers like the point is this particular if you look at this you realize that the nature of this design is that this is the graduating class so I, i'm suspecting that the names of these persons are actually the names of the graduating students so it depends on what you want to it depends on your purpose or the intent of trying to create the effect so that is what you determine your text but then since this particular one i mean this tutorial i don't really have any text in mind so i'm just going to i'm just going to use um in his key subscribe and then i'm not going to use a lot of text the idea is is to show you how to do it so that's just a simple idea here i just want to show you how to do so that you will know how to do it and then you can always um you can always um try it out in your own way so i'm going to use iniski i'm going to use iniski um yeah i'm going to use iniski then i'll change the font let me just use a, a, a font similar to the one they use so i will use um bebas oh let me use vanguard let me use vanguard yeah let me use vanguard so yeah this is vanguard an amazing font yes so this is in his key here now one thing i i feel like he's going to take your time depending on the um depending on how many the text you are you are working with is and how different they are is the arrangement of your text because your text some some might have to be big so might have to be smaller than the other you get it so um yeah that is one thing that you need to take note of in trying to do this so um let me make this very small let me let me just change the, the name of this one to like so this is like a reminder that don't forget to like this video it is very very important please yes so <laughs> yeah like then copy it and then let me oh sorry okay all right let me just move this this one doesn't want to move so let me use my relative position so that it doesn't waste our time so we have um i'm going to change this one to subscribe yes yeah, subscribe so if you haven't subscribed to this is like a reminder that please subscribe to my um channel so that you don't miss out on amazing tutorials like this so we have subscribe yes we have subscribe okay just take out your time and arrange the text right i i'm not going to do all of that 
yeah i'm not going to show you how i'm going to do all of that so that this video does not get unnecessarily long and in fact it is not going to be very very long right i'm not going to do a lot of this text because like i showed like i told you earlier this is just me um trying to show you how to do it and so once you get once you know how to do it it will be easy for you to always um recreate it whenever you want to and whenever you have a demand to do that so i'm going to just um i'm going to do that quickly all right so i just did some now to make it more faster to make it uh, more faster i'm going to move this here then i'm just going to merge you know like i said you are going to arrange your text depending on how you want it so this particular video is like a practice video so that is why um that is why i am just arranging i'm just choosing any kind of text so please take note of that so i want to merge everything together yeah i want to merge everything together so that i can just um when i can resize it yes because it needs to fill up the space yeah we have this then i can just copy this and then um rearrange it rearrange it yes i can just copy this um let me see if i can do something like oh no that is not gonna work okay wow copy so you permit me to just arrange this anyhow sorry you have to permit me to just um i believe you get the point already like the um the major thing you need to understand in creating something like this um i believe you've gotten that already yes okay copy this because i don't want it to get too rowdy and at the same time okay let me just delete this and then let me click on text all right let me just fill up those empty spaces quickly all right so we have we have shared too uh, yeah this is also like a reminder so also share the video share the video if you actually get value share the video with at least someone so quickly let me just use this to um f fill up the spaces um yes let me increase the size of this here okay so that is the um that is the main thing you need to first do right that is the first thing that is the main thing you need to first do um in trying to achieve that effect you need to ensure that your text are well arranged yes you need to ensure that your text are well arranged carefully depending on how you want it depending on the um specificity of the project you are working on that requires this or that you want to use this um, effect in so that is one thing you need to consider yeah before you're just going on it going ahead to use the effect so um i think this is where i would like to stop but then this one is overlapping it's actually overlapping across um the other this guy here so i have to delete this because i don't want i don't want anyone to overlap right i don't want them to overlap so i'm going to copy and i'm going to use my own text there i'm going to change it to subscribe yes i'm going to change that to subscribe or notification okay let me subscribe but then ensure that i turn on your your notification too yeah <laughs> i wanted to also use that as a form of reminder so but then so quickly let me just arrange the remaining um yes yes okay all right i think i'm good now 
I think I'm actually good with this. Um, sorry, let me copy this. So that I can fill up this space. Let me just change that to like. Like. Alright, so this is good. I mean, this is okay now. Alright, this is okay. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is that I will tap on this. Now, click on transparent. Right? Can you see what I'm doing? So, the background is not white. Take note of that. The background is not white make the background transparent just come to this and change it to transparent now click on this and then save as image right i like to save in the best quality so i'm going to use ultra now change it to custom um okay for the sake of this video don't let me because i don't want it to get too long so i'm just going to save it um as that ultra so instead of just going to custom like i did you can change it to ultra now i want to save my project i want to save this as project so that i don't lose it in case i need to come back to edit anything and i will encourage you to always do that too you can just um typo typograph 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 like let me just use typographs and that is what we are dealing with so we have saving now don't forget i've saved this as png the next thing is now to come to my design where i want to effect the effect if you get that where i want to use the effect just like um let me bring in back our image our reference all right these are our two references this is one look at pes and then this is llb you can see it so um yes now if i want to effect this in the design you know i would have first created um some other parts of the design then let's say for example i want to use ini ini is the short form of my name right it is the um short form of iniski like my name is iniolua so let's just use ini for the sake of this tutorial now capital letter now something you need to understand is that whatever font you are using needs to be bold right it needs to be bold and it needs to be big you can see our references right so it, it, whatever text you are using needs to be very very bold so um taking that into consideration i want to use poppins right i want to use poppins black is there any is there any bolder version than black i think yeah black is the is the boldest version so this is in a so i'm going to increase my size i'm going to increase my size all right i think this is okay now i think this is okay yeah this is any but let me check our references again because all right you can see it so um or maybe we should use okay let's use this right you know you can always use any font like i said i'm just showing you how to do it at the end of the day you determine how you want it to be how, how you want yours to be so now that i have my text in here the next thing i have to do is just to click on texture um tap on this and then you now bring in the png can you see the png yeah the png um image so now just tap on it yeah look at this is it then mark it can you see it can you see it so we've been able to um we've been able to get it but then the reason why it's not perfect click um can you back okay the reason why it's not perfect is because you need to okay well let's do something quickly i want to do something quickly sorry so we have this now take note take note that if you are importing it don't convert this test to shape if you convert this test to shape this is what is going to happen let's ask mount to convert this um my text to shape how to convert text to shape is simple just bring in the shape and then um, you can now merge both together if you all right so i've been able to convert this to shape now so let's import it let's import um this particular guy here can you see that it's no longer visible all right it's no longer visible um Okay, let's do something let's do something quickly because i want to show you i want to um show, so that you can actually take note of what i'm trying to say so let me change the color of the text to another color 
um yeah let me change it to another color let me change it to this so that i can still be visible and then merge both together so merge both together now merge both together then this has formed a shape we've con convert uh, converted it to shape so click on this and then import it as texture now you can see that it has background can you see it has background so that is not what you want to do if you are using that text ensure that it is just text right ensure that it's just text and to do that like i said once you have your text ready then you can now import this as texture all right look at this okay now um depending on the depending on how long your text is in this case where i just use three like i only use three um letters as in e i n i um it's actually okay this way i can easily adjust it like i can just decide to adjust it a bit so that i can fit into it so we have this so this has fit into it now and you can also continue adjusting it using this like you can use this scale to adjust can you see can you see guys can you see you can actually adjust you can make it as small as you want you can increase it you can increase the size you can make it as big as you want can you see so this is it i think i should leave it at um 50. now don't maintain this ratio if not it can um sometimes it can distort your text so it can actually distort your text so there's no point um enabling this so you can just adjust this key depending on how you want it and then we have it like i said this is not very very perfect because my text here are just random text like you saw how i came about that so ensure that if you are creating yours you actually take out your time get your text right and then you are going to get something way more better than this but then we've been able to create our effect if i decide to change the color of the background you can you, you will see that it, it is still going to look at it yeah it's still going to reflect so don't convert your text to shape don't convert your text to shape just use it that way and import your image as texture thank you so much for sticking around to this point um you've been able to know how to create this effect don't forget to share this video with at least someone and then i'm going to see you in my next video